Find the values of the real numbers a, b and c if a times x plus 2 squared plus 7 is equal to 3x squared plus bx plus c for all x values and element of the real number set. So what we're going to do is multiply out any brackets that we have and then we're going to put like to like. So x plus 2 squared is really x plus 2 times x plus 2 which gives us x times x plus 2 plus 2 times x plus 2 which gives x squared plus 2x plus 2x plus 4 which simplifies to x squared plus 4x plus 4. So we must work out each side fully before we put like to like. So we've multiplied out the x plus 2 squared and we got x squared plus 4x plus 4 but don't forget that there's an a in front, so we've got brackets around it. Bring down the plus 7 that equals the 3x squared plus bx and plus c. Then we're going to multiply in the a. a by x squared is ax squared. a by 4x is 4ax. And a by 4 is 4a. Bring down the plus 7. And the right hand side stays the same, equals 3x plus bx plus c. Now we can group together the 4a and the plus 7 by putting brackets around it because technically this is the constant. I know there's an a involved here but there's no x attached on to either the 4a or the 7. So we group these together with brackets around them and they become the constant. So then we start matching up. So we have a in front of the x squared and 3 in front of the x squared. So we let these two equal each other. And what happens is the x squared cancels out and we get a is equal to 3. So what we're doing here is putting like to like. Then we have a look at the 4ax. So this term has a single x, not an x squared. And then we have a look at the bx. Again, this term has a single x, not an x squared. So we let 4ax equal to bx. The x is cancel and we're left with 4a is equal to b. And remember, we just found that a was equal to 3, so we swap that a for 3 with brackets around it, and 4 by 3 is 12, so b is equal to 12. And then lastly, we let 4a plus 7 equal to c, because 4a plus 7 is the constant on the left-hand side of the equals, and the c is the constant on the right-hand side of the equals. Although they do have a's and c's involved, they don't have any x's. So in that way, they are constants. So we let 4a plus 7 equal to c. So 4a plus 7 equals c. We swap the a for 3, because we got a is equal to 3. So we get 4 multiplied by 3. Plus 7 is equal to c. 4 by 3 is 12. And 12 plus 7 is 19. So c is equal to 19. So the question asks us to find the values of the real numbers a, b, c. We found a to be 3, b to be 12, and c to be 19. So what we did was we multiplied out the brackets on the left-hand side. There was no brackets on the right to multiply out. We multiplied out the brackets on the left-hand side, and then we grouped together our x squared, our x, and our constant. And then we put like to like by matching up the x squareds, matching up the x's, and then matching up the constants. And then we solved for a, b, and c.